Hello everyone. Well, you will see a mess in here in this table, but uh, what I try to do is uh, is what I've been doing in some other items. Try to sell the whole thing together. Um, um, this is a toroidal power supply transformer. Um, this here is a power regulator in a nice huge heat sink, probably five inches by four. This is the fuse with some elements attached. Um, this is the power the go and use another um, fuse in there this is another fuse too right here I'm sorry this is for not fuse this is for even 120 or or 220 it is it is set in 117 so you're able to you to go to 220 or 117 or 240 100 117 220 to 40 okay this is the other fuse and the power what I says inside is another fuse this is a the switch tuner on and off this is this the um, 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 capacitor just be careful don't touch the capacitor you know it can cause any um, you know they charge up and you have to be careful about that this is all the grounds right here all the grounds oh, it's kind of okay. what else um, the, of course I include the power cord the toroidal is a nice uh, let me tell you what is this the primary is 100 117 or 220 240 volts the secondary give us 23 12 15 15 and 9 volts a uh, the amperage is 1.5 one zero point three zero point three and three amps um, the model number is a uh, ZG I believe dash NR nine eight two point five zero dash N zero two slash zero one point zero seven I would, will take a picture so, so you could see it's very heavy and nice. You know those toroidal, toroidal um, they're very, very nice power supplies for many applications. Uh, well, uh, I just try to see if this really works. And uh, let me just tell you, I hope you can be able to read my multimeter right there. And this is the secondary. You see, they have two blues, two yellows, two orange, and two two greens. And uh, I want to turn it on. This is the switch. Let me just not touch anything. Okay. And uh, if I start with the one blue. And to the and it's 24 and one and the last um, green gave me 24 volts. If I move the two blues, it's 25. If I move to the two gel, gel oranges, it's 16. The two oranges, I mean the two orange are 16. The two yellows. 16 also and the two greens 
16 and a half anyway if I start to make combination between the wires I get a lot of results um, to to a lot of readings I'm sorry 15 point four thirteen thirteen fifteen if I I mean you can actually do thirteen two twelve three point two twelve three point four sixteen uh, point nine, not here thirteen, almost fourteen. Let's see. Point nine. One. So we basically are to the uh, the readings they mark in the secondary. Uh, this is uh, a twelve. And uh, what you see, uh, let me move again this one a little bit. I try to tell the readings if you can see the the um, the multimeter thirteen, fifteen, twenty four, three point one, thirteen. I, I know it's a combination when you get the uh, the nine volts. I not I need to keep looking for what is the wires to have the nine volts. Um, but um, I'm not able to find what is the twenty one. It's right there nine. This is between the the first blue and the the first orange. So well, basically, it's a lot. Of, and then let me move to the DC. And we have in the the reading we have in the uh, capacitor is is basically twelve volts. Okay. So it's really nice. Uh, what I said, I decided not to remove and sell the toroidal separate and the sink and whatever you know. I just want to sell the whole thing for fifty-four ninety-nine and twelve dollars of shipping, which is going to be in the medium flat rate box USPS. It's because I have this is the cheapest way. The USPS medium flat rate box is ten dollar eighty five, so it's just one dollar and fifteen cents for packaging and handling, which is, is I believe is pretty reasonable. So you have all the, the you see all the grounds. Let me turn it off. You have all the grounds in here. And well, this was this was removed from the. Uh, from uh, lab equipment, um, so there's the five amp, five amps uh, voltage regulator. This guy here, and um, well, what you see in here is what you get. I definitely try to pack everything in real good uh, condition, so. I just gonna leave everything as is. I don't wanna uh, remove what I tell you. You can actually do 220 if you want. And um, well, I believe the uh, I believe this guy is is go is dropping the voltage. Yeah. So I'm able to touch it now. It's not. You know, but be careful if you have to do this you have to set up nicely and it's a lot of possibilities with this uh, 
large range of of voltages and for many applications. Fifty four ninety nine and twelve dollar for shipping. USPS priority mail medium flat rate box. I will try to take some pictures and well you see is what you get. I try to be um, I try to mention all the parts to came with and well this will be in the force helpers and thank you for watching.